con toda la doncella. <laughs> All right, man. Hang on, beat drop podcast episode six. Damn. How you feeling, bro? I'm feeling great. You feel good? Yeah, a little buzz, a little tipsy, a little hungover, a little bit of everything. Yeah, I could tell. I could tell. Um, you have no. your glasses on, bro. You uh, no. Too cool for school right now, dog. Yeah, bro. I be looking like a zombie right now, bro. <laughs> Do we? Hey, you want to give yours or not? Bro? <laughs> <laughs> you gonna be like, oh hell no. Yeah, like. <laughs> uh, <laughs> nah. So birthday weekend just passed for you. How I you did. feel? You feel good? I feel great. Yeah. Yeah. It was amazing. How old are you now? Twenty six. Twenty six. Twenty six. Oh, look, 26, episode 6. Hey. Makes sense. How you feel, though? You feel like, you know, you had a good year? You feel like, you know, I feel like this year, you know, a lot of I, shit happened? Yeah, I, I feel that um, I tw- I'm glad. Mm-hmm. You know, I'm 26. I'm glad shit, because I didn't see myself making it past 21 the way mm. I was going. You know what I mean? So <laughs> those five extra years, baby. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was good. It was good. But now it feels amazing, you know, being back in Cali. Mm-hmm. Hey, I'm just going to say, bro, everybody that came out, shout out to you guys. I mm-hmm. saw people out there that didn't. I haven't seen him like years since I left. It was amazing to bond with them. How did that feel seeing like old high school friends and fucking people you used to interact with and shit back in the day? Bro, it was amazing. It's yeah. one of those where you can't take friendship for granted and you know. Never. And it's one of those where when you get in touch with those people and shit, mm-hmm. it, it it feels like it was just yesterday. And it feels it is crazy. Yeah, I feel like it's crazy because like, like everybody just is doing different shit. But then you guys just start talking, and then it's like back to normal shit. You know what I'm saying? Exactly, bro. It's like if 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 time didn't even pass like that. Like we were just kicking it yesterday and shit. True that. True mm-hmm. that. I like you, that. You know, you think time is gonna pass for fucking Drake to respond, or what's up? Like, oh, talking about <laughs> that, bro. Hey, I, I honestly, I heard a little bit some some that. Supposedly he tweets. might drop something in his new album with Lil Wayne. You think so? But I was like, eh, it's taking forever. But I, at the I, same I time, think I think it came to a point where I don't think he's gonna respond, bro. Think he so? should, he, for what now? Like, what's yeah. what's the point? Like There's the been, time like, passed weeks. already, so yeah, it's, it's don't it's respond, like, bro. All your ghostwriters can get something right. Oh, <laughs> what's wrong with you, dog? You gotta chill, dog. <laughs> like, come on, bro. You got like thirty of them, not like that. Have, have you listened to Pusha T's album? Because of the diss, you feel like people have been more familiar now. Like, well, yeah, who's Pusha T? Like, and then yeah. they're like, well, I mean, he album. he always had a little crowd, you know, his crowd. Well, not little. He always had yeah, a like crowd, his following but and shit. at the same time, it's different when you go like Drake and his crowd is yeah. It's a little bit different, but I, I'm, I'm, he has some heat, yeah. some flames. That's crazy, man. Um, you know, you know what? Actually, I was super fucking excited about, and I feel like I was waiting years for, is Kid Cudi and Kanye. Man, that shit, that album sounded dope. I don't Wait, how been, long? How long? Like it was like what five, six? No, well, I don't think they've, I don't think they've ever had a like a collaborative album. I think they just worked. Oh, together. you're talking about the collab? I thought you're yeah. talking about like Kid Cudi from his last. No, album. no, no. I'm it's, talking it's about been like a while too. No, no. Yeah, bro. I'm talking about like them both having an album together and shit yeah. and then once you hear Kid Cudi go the who I want you're hey, like that shit like, go. Damn, did that sound like him or not not really little little bit like, a little bit like that paisita one I'm like about paisa about it damn now I was excited bro like have you listened to it or not like you haven't really like give it a the listen the Kanye I listened out of uh, the seven I probably like three maybe four a little still trying to fill it out you gotta give it some more yeah, time yeah but that Kid Cudi's yeah, something bro. Else. That's Kid- something that I miss about him. Damn, that shit. That shit sounded good, man. I was excited to hear it. I was like, damn, like finally. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You know what the else? The wait is over. <laughs> yeah, the wait is over. You know what else has been taking a long time, and it's finally gonna come out. Is Incredibles two? Exactly. <laughs> hey, now that we talking about it, if you guys are viewing us, man, keep your motherfucking babies at home. <laughs> I waited ten plus. Yeah, <laughs> just to watch this shit. And they, like, you ain't fucking up my vibe. Hey, you ain't gonna fuck up my vibe. I'm trying to see what Jack Jack's got and shit. <laughs> nah, low key, I, I told Jacob, I told my son, I was like, look, you better not fucking be on some stupid shit, all right? You better stop talking because you're not fucking on my movie and you shit. I, I'm considering leaving him with my mom, bro. Nah, fuck you it. got to, bro. <laughs> you got to. Be like, yo, I gotta go do this. Ta 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 ta. Bam. Sit down. You know nah, what? We already got tickets too. anyway, so we ain't gotta worry about that. <laughs> We already got front row tickets. You feel me? You feel me? We ain't got to worry about that. And they're smart, bro. They're dropping that shit on like Father's Day weekend, bro. Yeah. So be like, you know what? Mm. Yeah. Like this two is for the price of one. Yeah. And I'm like, wait, but that doesn't make sense, man. Because the dad got to take the kids and shit. Yeah. It's but it's cool, cool, man. I you know. know what I'm I know. It happens. You do anything for your dad for Father's Day or not? Uh, probably. Yeah. Take him out. Yeah. Take him out to dinner and shit. He I'm deserves it. I'm thinking if I should make my Take my dad. He you don't deserve, deserve it. Shit. Nah, nah, same here, bro. Come and think about it now. It's all yeah. going out to nah, the table. Nah, fuck that. I ain't even a positive. Fuck, give me something. You know? What nah. happened to Dia de los Niños and yeah. shit? You feel me? Y'all did me dirty. You know, it's crazy. I remember, I, like, um, uh, before I was a dad, I used to tell my mom, like, yo, is there, like, a, 
El Dia de los Niños and shit. Like, yo, when are you going to huh, give like, us some shit? Up? Like, what's up with us giving, giving, y'all? Yeah, giving and my mom hit me with the, when you start paying rent, shut the fuck up. Huh, I and I Kevin was like, shit. like, yo, when you stop paying bills, yeah. you stop paying rent, then <laughs> yeah. you come talk to me. <laughs> Meanwhile, I need you to shut the fuck up and go to the yeah, motherfucking yeah. room right now. And, and I'm, I'm like, like well, fuck, why you got to talk about it like that? Like, yeah, you know like it was just a question. Yeah, well, you asked too many questions, huh? Are you related to 50 Cent and shit? Like, what the fuck? Where'd this come from? Like, damn, how do you even know about 50 Cent? yeah. She's like, you know what? You're getting me more mad. You ever heard of the window shopper? That's what we're about to do next for your birthday. <laughs> Bro, dog, do you feel like when, when when it was your birthday, like your mom wanted to buy you gifts? Or do you feel like she was like, she would low-key give you excuses like, oh, like time is tough right now and shit? I think it your- was a little bit of both. Yeah. But at the same time, like in high school, I just stopped giving a fuck and I started doing my own parties. I was like, you know what? Hey. Yeah. And then they'll be like, you going now? I was like, yeah, I'm going yeah. now. Like, Yo, you know what's crazy? And I always feel fucking guilty about this shit. So hopefully my mom listens to this episode. I always feel bad. You know what's crazy? What I remember that when I was in middle school, I really wanted uh, the fucking um, the GameCube. Remember the GameCube? Oh, hell Not yeah. GameCast. Yeah. <laughs> Not the Dreamcast, but the GameCube, yeah, the you GameCube. know? I remember that I was like, yo, I really wanted the fucking system, right? And I think it was like my birthday. And I really thought that I was going to get it. Like, I was like, yo, I feel like my dad knows. I feel it. Like, I Everybody. feel it, you know? And then, like, I opened my presents. And then, like, they didn't give me the GameCube, bro. They gave me, like, some other toys and shit. And I was pissed, bro. Like, I was mad. Like, I was seriously fucking mad. Like, yeah. imagine me, like, being a fucking asshole. Like, I was mad, bro. And I remember my mom was like, you like your presents? And I was like, like, whatever. Like, I was in a fucking, like, huh, attitude and, like, and shit. like, bro, y'all, why y'all fuck? Hey, bro, you want to know some fuck this shit yeah. my dad did to us once? It was Christmas, bro. Me and my <laughs> brother, we wanted the PS2. I think it was a PS2. Yeah. Yeah, it was a PS2. And um, so... Bro, we measured the case, everything, bro. I'm telling you, my Brian Medica, he had it going down. This food was taken out the tape. We saw at the edge of it. It was right there. PS2. <laughs> it was like, ooh. We're like, we got this shit, yeah. bro. Yeah. And it was the next day. We were waiting for it. We all put it back nice and everything. Uh-huh. And we're right here like, hey, when we open it, we came yeah. to an agreement. We got to look surprised. Like, oh, yeah, like, oh shit. Oh, my God. PS2, you know? Yeah. And we, we did low key. We're like, yeah. oh, he's like, open it, open it. And then this motherfucker got us closing books, bro. <laughs> and we, oh, bro, I was about to cry, bro. I was dying, bro. I was like, That's no, fucked up, bro. no. And and bro, I was like, man, I went, I went to my room, bro, because he knows I'm a gamer. He's like, yeah. I wanted that shit, bro. I went to my room and everything, and he's all like, nah, I'm playing with you. Look, Damn. I, and my dumbass didn't even look at the TV. He's all like, that shit's already connected. Oh, he looked out. Yeah, bro, and it was right there, bro. And I felt bad, but at the same time, he got me, though. I was like, oh, that's cool. Bro, that shit's crazy because I remember, bro, I swear, bro, like, I was pissed, man. Like, we went to Chuck E. Cheese, and I remember my older brother, my older brother, Eswin, he was like, yo, like, what's wrong, man? Like, you know, and I was like, nah, man, I wanted the GameCube and shit. And he <laughs> was like, he was like, bro, like, don't be like that. Like, be grateful, you yeah. know? Whatever, time passed. And I remember uh, I graduated, I think it was from middle school. Yeah, middle school was around that time. And then um, my mom was like, told my dad, like, hey, um, go take Brian. You're going to uh, go buy him a GameCube right now and shit. And oh, I feel like shit. shit, bro. Like, you know when you feel guilty? Yeah. Because, like, I was like, damn. Like, my, my parents, were up, they were, like, looking out for me. But I just wasn't patient. You know what I'm saying? Like, it was fucked up. Because I, I remember my mom felt bad. Like, she came home and I was being a little fucking asshole and shit like oh nah bro well, you know what i mean look at us now they deserve yeah for us being like that you feel yeah, me what the fuck if anything they lucky I, said, <laughs> you feel me? I was about to pack my bags <laughs> was, me and him are out on some kevin hart shit <laughs> like we out this mug we don't need this damn man nah but that that was cool and i remember in middle school i used to play i used to play a little basketball too bro hey, i used to ball up you know what bro? i'm saying yeah it was pretty nice you know what i mean yeah. but low-key um now that i'm thinking about basketball and shit fucking Cavs got swept bro Bro, <laughs> don't even talk about that, bro. I was like, nah, LeBron's not going to get swept. He's not going to let that happen. Duh. But the Warriors are like on some savage shit. Then, and at the end of the day, it was at their court too. Bro, like that shit's crazy. Like, okay, so so I want to talk about that shit. Cause, Let's talk like, about yeah, because I'm like, do you feel like LeBron was the one that started the whole super team shit? Or do you feel like that just happened throughout time or it happened before? Nah, there's there's been some teams before. Yeah, think about it. Uh, Boston had Paul Pierce, had Allen, Rondo, Garnett, bro. They had a good ass squad. And do you think but like did ahead. he add it to that? Yeah, yeah. Obviously, he added to that. I think I don't know if it was Charles Barkley or somebody that was like LeBron started the whole super team shit, and now it's coming to bite him in the ass. Do you feel like that's true? Nah, because nah. think about it. If I think he's wrong with that one, because 
all the players the Warriors got was still mm. the draft. If you really think about it, yeah, it the only one, a, yeah, the only one that was that got there after was KD, and and, and they already and, won a championship before, yeah. yeah, and they already won a championship before, yeah, you before know, before he came in, yeah. But at the same time, that set the bar, like, bro, that team's unbeatable right now. Yeah, if there's a team that could probably beat them, bro, mm-hmm. and LeBron will go to it, but I don't know if Kyrie will be able like to play with him again. It's Boston because they. What have, about Houston? I think Houston. Oh, Houston, got, yeah, Houston too. There They're saying go, that yeah. he might go to Houston too. I wouldn't mind if he came to L.A. Bron, Bron, what's up? Come yeah, to L.A. But, you know? hey, time is counting, bro. And that's something. Are you willing to wait three more years for another championship? <sighs> I'm not saying that's how long it's going to take the Lakers, yeah. but they're still on some rebuilding mode. Like, yeah, they there's got a difference. Like, and I know people are going to be like, yo, how are you going to say Boston and Lakers? Mm-hmm. But low-key, Boston nailed it on the draft and getting their people. They got some young bucks there, bro. They got some heat there, bro. Some and the Lakers, studs. I'm not saying they don't got no, like, they, they haven't nailed it because Kuzma came yeah. out of nowhere, bro. Londo is still, like, in rebuilding. Like, yeah, he's just trying to figure that yeah. out. Yeah. So they got good players, too. But it's one of those where Ingram's coming back from an injury, and he's still trying to see what's up with that. But it's one of those where it's like... Right now, like besides being you being a Laker fan, if you had to go with a team that's gonna make it far, who would it be? Celtics or Lakers? And as much as you want to say Lakers, like you yeah. both know the truth, you know. Fuck, unless he gets fucking paid, but I don't even think he cares about the money right now. Well, like, honestly, he probably cares about yo. If you want to be his legacy the at best, this point, yeah. Fuck yeah, man! They got fucking swept, and I was like, fuck, like that shit's crazy, bro. And then like in the last game, like the last five, like couple minutes, I don't know if you saw it. Like he was just saying, like he was like congratulating, like. The Warriors and shit. I'm like, damn, that's like, bro, I, that takes a lot, bro. Yeah, dog. Think about it. but also they know, bro. They can't like not to talk shit. Curry and all of them know that they're not better than him, bro, and bro. I don't think they'll ever. Well, he was be the best player in in that court uh, yeah. on, on that court. You know, what but I'm when you have like multiple fucking players on. A squad and B squad yeah. is one of those where it's like, all right, LeBron needs a break too. You feel yeah, me? He's dog. human. Like it's motherfucking. He he's not a robot. The, okay, and do you feel like his, his he had help? Because I don't like. I know people were kind of like, yo, like he's doing it all, but like at some degree, I feel like his squad was not like bad. Like no, no. Okay, look, Kevin his Love, squad like, wasn't bad, but I, I see they just this weren't paper. helping him. Like yeah, I seen this paper where it's a one through ten. It was LeBron, mm-hmm. four players from. Uh, the Warriors, mm-hmm. then it was like one player from the Cavs, mm-hmm. two players from the Warriors, and then the last two were probably like Cavs. Just one of them. They weren't consistent. One too. of them is way better than the and other. Ca- and you know what's the thing too, bro? I feel like after game one, like you already knew it was going to go to shit because that they, they had an opportunity, opportunity couple, to win yeah. game one on the road and, two. and build off that momentum. You know what I'm saying? No, was it? Yeah, two or three. Game two, they were. I think they were kind of close. I think that's. The, yeah, when they went to overtime, remember? They went overtime, right? Yeah, I think so, yeah. No, no, no. That was game one. I think that was game one. Yeah, oh, you're right, because yeah, yeah, he yeah. missed. Yeah, but okay. Still, bro, so game like, one fuck, was bro, supposed they could've, to be. They could have fucking steal game one on the road. Like, they could have. That, that would have been a whole momentum change, bro. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, but I don't know, man. That, that's crazy. I, I mean, he like, I saw, like, the interviews after, and he was just like, you know, my kids are older, so I got to talk to my fam, make that decision if I'm going to stay in Cleveland. I don't think he's staying in nah, Cleveland. Hell nah, Why bro. would you want to fucking stay in Cleveland? You know what I'm saying? How long do you think the Warriors got? With that team, like, well, feel I like it's know. too good People, to be two right I, now. I honestly, I know two other stars got to get paid. Yeah, because KD's gonna get a contract this year, I think. Some well, for sure, you're keeping KD, bro. You got to and Curry. That's yeah. for fact. The rest, they're everybody else is. You either gonna get a pay, you either gonna take a pay cut or young you guys are gonna get traded uh, that team is it's good for five more years damn I just they up. just gotta keep you know not be selfish you know not let they egos keep, get in the yeah. way yeah and then they're good but i'm not gonna lie it's, that's probably i think this is swaggy piece second championship huh? no 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 it's his first, first his first championship that's why he was fucking turned oh he did was you like hear about that quote he said he said i went from I'm being getting uh, snitched on uh, to, to get getting a ring, ring. oh <laughs> savage for uh, that, that one just hilarious, but i wish the lakers were like that right now honestly yeah but they're gonna get back on it yeah i feel i feel like fuck like, it feels we weird trust. yeah it feels weird because like you know I've, I've, I've watched kobe for so many years and like you always felt like there was gonna be a chance we're gonna be all right you know what i'm saying yeah. and now it's like he's gone it just feels like a different type of like energy it's gonna take time to pick it up you know what i mean but hey, I'm not gonna lie, you know me. I never liked Kobe, but I always yeah. respected his oh, game. Oh damn, people gonna fucking hate nah, you. Nah, it don't this matter. They gonna That's hate cool. you. Dog. They gonna hate you. Oh nah, damn, you ready but, for all hey, the shots? Yeah, I'm ready. <laughs> Bring him, baby. No, but it's just, bro. You gotta respect the man's game, bro. He was an animal. Bro, he's a beast. In that court, bro, he was fucking amazing. Going bro. in, huh? <laughs> nah, man. But what's up, man? Um, 26 years old. 
you feel um you feel like you got any goals that you uh kind of were thinking about throughout from our last episode and shit you feel like you kind of live in right now or what's up what's yeah, good bro i mean i'm just i'm just riding the wave bro i like that i'm just riding the wave but making sure i don't stay out of the lane yeah. Ooh, you know? we gonna write, we can't write that shit yeah write that shit lane. <laughs> nah, yeah, bro. Hey, bro. I feel like I'm. I'm not gonna lie. Ever since I came back to Cali, mm-hmm. it's been amazing, bro. A you lot of good, good things been happening. I've been seeing a lot of good vibe people. I've been fucking with people. Like it's crazy. Yeah. It's no, good. man. It's that's good. that. Like that it. feels good. And then I want to give a shout out to all the people that have been graduating too. You know what I'm oh, saying? It's yeah. a lot of graduations. You know what I mean? Like it's crazy, bro. Like you know, like even for me, like my little one, like he, flying, bro, baby. he was in pre-K and he's about to get into kindergarten, and I'm like, That's dog, crazy. like it's the most craziest feeling and shit. You know what I'm saying? Is Fuck he yeah. still gonna have the same teacher? Nah, bro. That shit was sad. Like, uh, like yeah, bro. Like he went and like he was like, I'll see you tomorrow, and then like. I don't think he really understands that he's not gonna see her in a teacher. Like you could tell she got all sad and yeah. shit. And I'm like, fuck. Nah, we could still take her. <laughs> come back to go see her. I mean, you know, a little visit. You know what I mean? Nah, yeah, man. Take but a nap fucking or two. Father's Day, man. I want to shout out to all the pops. You know what yeah, I'm saying? Because yeah. I always feel like, you know, what's crazy. I feel like for Mother's Day, shit, it'd be cracking. Hey, like a restaurant, yeah, it'd be like, like for, mariachi and everything. And, and for Father's, Father's Day, oh, it's like, Day. here, have, have a good one. All right, here you go. Here's a gift card Beer, to whatever. fucking Marshalls <laughs> and shit. Like, what the fuck, bro? That's not cool, dog. I mean, I got a goldfish, bro, but. <laughs> like that motherfucker look he be looking at me like you're a real one nah man but for real it's fucking father's day so you know wish your pops if you know people that all of us who are fortunate to still have our dads man you know you gotta you know you got you got you got love family man you know what i'm saying but i feel like we had a good weekend you know what i'm saying we really did. everything was good so happy birthday to you my brother thank you baby you know what i'm saying 26 years Let's young you know what i'm saying and i feel like june's like well, obviously, it yeah. is the middle of the year, mm-hmm. but that's what sets it off. Like, no, yeah. oh, this summer, bro. Summer right here. Mm. Oh, mm. man. <laughs> it's about to go down, dog. No, no. Nas is about to get dropped. Nas is about to get dropped. You know, oh, and shout out to uh, my homie, Track Called Hip Hop. You know, he wants to stop by because he, he wants to talk about, he wants to review the album with us. Oh, the Nas. Uh, I said, let's do it. Yeah, let's run he, it. And he fucking, he's a major hip hop head. So that'll be fun for him to, to be in here and shit. But yeah, man, 26, man. You know what I mean? Time flies, bro. I feel like it was just yesterday when we were going to a house party and lying to my mom, bro. So, yeah. <laughs> And you know what's crazy now? What's up? That when I went out this weekend, even though I saw pe- people still go out. Yeah, bro. You know, like people still got time to, you know, like. It's just not like weekly shit. It's not no, like no, before, no, it's you not. know, like they, they kind of know when, when to go out and be responsible and shit. So. Yeah, because they were hitting me up. They're like, yo, I still see you and Brian go out. You yeah. feel me? But it's more about like business and shit. Yeah. But they're like, you guys still go out. You guys should hit us out. I was like, oh, don't worry. We'll establish a team. <laughs> we'll yeah, call we, it the A team. Yeah, you we got to get an A team for you the summer, me? bro. Like, yo, so, hit us up. We'll so go accepting out. We'll all applications, you, you know me? what I'm saying? <laughs> let us know. You want to come out? Let us know. Yeah, man, I feel good. Let's, let's, it's an another new week you know what i'm saying let's fucking kick ass you know that was For a weak ass punch wow. i don't even know what the you fuck that the shit out of me and shit we is out